All right. Not bad. All right, guys. We are uh, fishing some skinny. That's not bad for a little fish. How fat that dude is. Anyway, we're fishing some really skinny water today. Uh, tight quarters. As you can see, this is it's going to be an interesting float. Maybe we'll catch a few fish. Maybe we won't. Let's go see. Oh, jeez. Missed that one. Let's see if we'll come back on the float. There he is. Nice. And to have him some of that swarm. Oh, that's not too shabby. Oh. Missed him on that buzz bait and he come back and got it. That's a good spot. Oh. There he is. Oh god. Drennel. Oh, stop it. I see him spinning around. Old trash fish. Uh, yeah. Them dudes right there ain't good for nothing. Tearing stuff up. Look. Yeah, slimy. That's a monster. Oh, hit ground. Yeah. Uh, I'm come right up the boat and get it. I get a fish. Mm. Pull me around. Uh, let's go back this way. Uh -uh. Oh crap. Uh. Good night. Uh. Keep him out of the bushes. Come on up here. Dang. Yes, sir. Usually this float's good for one good fish. I need bad. Better than a grinnel. Not bad at all. I had to have some of that crankbait. Nice fish. All right, guys, today we're catching white perch. It's a little windy, but as soon as it starts getting colder, I like fishing for white perch. You start bunching back up. This is the deepest part of the pond right here I'm fishing. These white perch will stack in there. And hitting about any little jig you throw in there. That's not a bad little perch. Hang on, I'll show you what I'm fishing with. And I got these little paddle tails made by Strike King on an eighth ounce jig head. And, uh, Use a six pound test. It's this windy, it's hard to feel your bite. Most of the time you just feel a little bumpy, you can set the hook, you know, they just sucked it in. Day's a little harder. I had to watch my line more carefully. Hello. Look at that. Have a tree limb fall on my head. 